Welcome back YouTube. And now we have the last of my pa um, Popo fantasy anthro characters, the Gator. And I saved him for last because he is my favorite. This character is just incredible. The scale work on this guy is beautiful. I mean, look at those legs. Look at the scaling work on the neck and on the along the jawline. Um, and look at this back. I mean, look at look at that. It's just so well done. And this tail has just so massive, so sweeping. You know, this is a dynamic weapon that he'd be using in combat. Um, he's a large shoulder piece here. Um, he's wearing a. a, a armor piece from elbow all the way down which is nice on uh, this arm he has has a greave i mean a forearm guard he has a greave here and a knee cop um this leg is uh, is bare so it's very much giving you that impression of a gladiatory um combatant and then you have a, a nice piece of armor here across the stomach where a in real life a uh, a gator or an alligator um has a crocodile or a gator has their the most vulnerability that's the softest spot so that would make perfect sense and he's also carrying a hammer which i or a, or a mace which i really appreciate because i'm a big fan of blunt weapons um, and he's wearing these nice little thigh guards here which are which are cool and has a, a suitably impressive um one-handed sword in uh, in his left hand i mean look at the detailing on that on that armor that's just really nicely done you didn't have to go to that you could have just left that plain silver but the but the people that worked on this didn't i mean look at that you can get see right inside that that maw this character is incredibly impressive if i you saw this thing storming across a gladiatorial um arena at you you'd be quaking in your shoes i mean this this is a powerful and incredibly cool character i see this character and i just want to create him in a game and play him 